We're going to begin with that ballot bag issue. The Postal Service and the Santa Clara County Register of Voters are investigating a potentially problematic discovery. Reports of a bag stuffed with valid, completed Santa Clara County ballots in a ravine in the Santa Cruz Mountains. In a story you'll see only on NBC Bay Area, our Robert Honda joins us from San Jose to tell us what's being done. Well, two of the people whose ballots were recovered told us they mailed them off from this post office here on Payne Avenue in West San Jose. Now, we only reported the discovery to the Registrar of Voters and the Postal Service late this afternoon, so those investigations are just getting underway. But this is how it started. Lou and Janet Whitkin made sure they mailed off their ballots early the Saturday before the election. But here is where it appears their ballots ended up in a torn bag reportedly discovered off Sugarloaf Road near Highway 17 in the Santa Cruz Mountains. How? How did it get from the mailbox to Santa Cruz? Uh, just disappointing to me that uh, something could have transpired. I'm interested in the facts. So wanted to uh, see, well, what was the situation? Uh, was it something that uh, uh, that was dropped in transit? You know, what were the circumstances? Julie Neiman would like to know as well. She tells us she was riding her motorcycle to work when she spotted the torn bag and noticed the ballots. She said she feels like someone was trying to make sure the bag of ballots wouldn't be found. They were trying to make it look so people wouldn't find them is the way I saw it. They were dumped over the edge of the road down this deep uh, ravine that goes pretty far and is very steep. The Santa Clara County Registrar of Voters was reluctant to speculate on exactly what happened or how those ballots reportedly ended up in the Santa Cruz Mountains, but closely examined the pictures NBC Bay Area provided. Well, it appears in the pictures that there are ballots mixed in with non-election material. So with seeing that, you would think this may have come from the postal stream somehow. Again, both the post office and the registrar are now investigating this incident together. The registrar also wanted to remind voters you can track your ballot by going through its website to make sure your ballot ends up where it's supposed to. In San Jose, Robert Honda, NBC, Bay Area News. Okay.